Somalia's electoral summit continues in Dusamara Friday. Former Hershebele president Mohamed Abdiware confirmed in a tweet that many issues have been agreed upon. But he also indicated there is still mistrust that commitments will be kept. While several agreements have been reported, most still leave work to do to get a final pact. Jubaland will hold balloting in several cities, not just Kismail. Amazon will provide security. But President Mohamed Farmajo and Jubaland leader Ahmed Madobe disagree over federal troops in the Gato region. Madobe left the talks Thursday night over the issue. Senate Speaker Abdi Hashi and Deputy Prime Minister Mahdi Gouled will determine Somaliland's representation. The two are reported to be deadlocked on the process. There is general consensus that lists be made of members to remove from both the federal and state election teams. Then those bodies will be reconstituted. What to be done after Formaggio's mandate runs out Monday is still unresolved. International partners are concerned enough to issue new statements urging talks to continue to a negotiated solution. The United Nations statement calls on all of Somalia's leaders to find consensus on electoral implementation as an urgent matter of national interest. The American Embassy in Mogadishu followed up the UN statement saying, The FMS and FGS must resolve all differences and carry out on-time elections with no partial or alternative processes. Al-Shabaab mortar attacks and gunfire could be heard again late Thursday near the summit. Leaders continue to persevere despite the danger. ADN-TV will report updates Friday as the negotiations continue.